So how did flooding affect your daily life, if at all? The water? Mm -hmm. It didn't affect me as much as it affected the people that live there in those areas. Uh, but, uh, well, yeah, to some degree because we couldn't go make the usual visits we would make with yeah. our clients and that was the main thing I guess that affected us. Mm -hmm. How extreme was the flooding? How extreme was mm -hmm. the flood? Yeah. Well, I always go by what I was just telling him about going down Route 50 in our boat. You could almost reach out and stand up in the boat and reach the top of the telephone pole where the T was. And uh, the water was very deep. But those were the days when George Field was going and the guys that went back and forth to the airport, they had their, their big boats that they could put, you know, several men in at the time to bring them in town like on Saturday night or take them back or something to the hospital if they had to go. They had their own watercraft, but the, the people that lived in just had to go a different direction to get to Vincennes, you know, you could, I think that early on, probably Route 50 got where you could get over there. It was the first way to get the east out of here, when, as the water got down. Uh, when I was younger, my dad would tell me stories of how when it flooded on that road, his brother and him would go out and ice skate. Was it really like that bad at times, like to where everything would just freeze over? Uh, yes, I did, but I don't remember much about the freezing, but I do vaguely remember it happening. But, you know, I don't, I wasn't around it at that time. And did you hear anything about property damage or? Well, there were, I'm sure there were a lot of people, if they had flood insurance on their homes, of course they were lucky, but uh, my guess would be that a very small percentage of people ever bought flood insurance. They didn't think they would ever need it. Yeah. And it was kind of a new thing on the, on the, you know, on the markets, especially in this area where we're not used to floods like that. But uh, there probably were just a few people that maybe benefited by, by flood insurance, but I would say very few. Yeah. Uh, did the flooding change any of the landscape, like a before and after? I can't address that, but I don't know. I really don't know for sure, but I don't, I'd say very little, very little. Mm 